Right, keep that shit at the crib, right. Funky bitch. Shit crazy, man. Right, leave that shit at the crib, right. This old nappy head bitch. I just lost your whole fucking paycheck in a half hour, bitch. And you talk about maybe you had a bad day. Peasy head bitch. Bitch head was nappy as shit. Fucking straight comb, hot comb, nothing could help that bitch. That's why you mad at life, peasy head ass. Two, there's two motherfuckers you can always guarantee gonna be mad at life. A peasy head bitch, a peasy head woman, and a fucking little dick nigga. They always gonna be mad at life. There's two motherfuckers you can guarantee gonna be mad at life. A bitch with a peasy ass head and a fucking little dick nigga. They mad at God. Every time, every time a bitch see a motherfucker with some luxurious and glorious head, that bitch like, <gasps> ah, ah. Fucking hot comb shorty. That's your fucking nickname, bitch. Hot comb shorty. Got me mad as shit. About to risk my freedom knocking this nigga the fuck out. We got to talk about this shit. Why y'all black women be so mad at the world, man? For real. Get a dirty, dusty dick nigga. Fuck y'all over to y'all mad at the fucking world. Why y'all be acting like that? Acting like what? Like y'all be fucking mad at the fucking world. We don't act like we mad at the world. Huh? How we act how we act like we mad at the world. Cause y'all be having fucking attitude problems. Prime example. Of a day. I'm walking into somewhere. A black girl was walking out. I'm like, how you doing? Just cause we walking past each other. This bitch look at me like, I'm like, bitch, I ain't trying to talk to you, you fucking ugly. <laughs> and bitch, you, you mistaken a nigga like me that I'm like, I'm trying to talk to you, bitch, and you look like that. <laughs> bitch, you ugly as me, bitch. The fuck would I be trying to talk to you for? No, we don't even be mad. It's what the boring. fuck is up with that shit like? Bitches be looking boring. like Scotty Pippen in the fucking face, acting like they looking at it, looking at me like this. Cause I said hi. I'm walking past. You just close like you doing. Bitches be bored. Like bitches just bored and they gotta wear weave and that don't got hair. They won't be mad and always mad. They won't be mad because they don't got no hair. They don't got nothing to brush. Like, I don't they be understanding that shit. Like, like, I don't they be understanding that shit. They talk all that shit about white women. I, every time I walk past a white person, I'll be like, how you doing? Hey, 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 how are you? Hey, hey. I walk past a black person, I'm like, hey, how you doing? 
bitch. I said, how you doing? I ain't trying to talk to you, bitch. You couldn't even wipe to the ass, bitch. You think a fucker trying to talk to you? Why are you so angry today? Because this fucking girl just made me fucking hot, man. I was on fire to the point where I told the security guard, come outside then. You come off this post right here and you come outside, I'm going to knock you, you clean the fuck out as soon as you walk out this casino. Because this motherfucker started talking to me crazy. Well, he was bald. No, he was a fat fucking white dude. You know that white people always want to get smart. It don't matter. About. It don't matter. I said to him, I said, so you, you, you mean to tell me it's cool to bring your attitude to work? What, what do you mean you... you the fuck are you talking about? You brought your attitude to but work. You can't let them, pe them type of people affect you. This motherfucker talking about don't cuss at her. I said, I didn't cuss at her. I said, what, what the fuck do you mean you brought your attitude to work? That's not cussing at her. What the fuck are you talking about? You know what? You can get out. No. No, I just lost some money in this bitch. Put me the fuck out. How about you put me out? And I bet you I'll knock your ass clean out right here. You should have just told him my his fucking business and kept it pushing. Like, he wasn't fuck. supposed to let him get you this heated. Come on now. Come on now. Let me tell you something. I do all that shit for the kids and all that shit. I'm still a nigga. Mm -hmm. Who get that fucked up? Oh, funky ass bitch. Talk about you brought your attitude to work. Maybe I had a bad day. <laughs> so you taking it out on me? It's the, it's it's crazy. I'm trying to tell you. Cause your I fucking mean, head peasy. You want to take it out on me? Cause your fucking head peasy. It go both ways though, because y'all y'all men be coming home from a long day of work or. Y'all didn't do something, and y'all come home pissed off, and y'all take it out on us. No, no, no. Hold on. See, see, that ain't got nothing to do with a bitch being at work at the casino. I'm leaving out this casino. I'm like, all right, y'all have a good night. And the bitch look at me like, and I'm like, damn, um, did I do something to you? I said, if I did something to you, let me apologize. This is what I said to the bitch. Because, yeah. bitch, you act like, <laughs> like, I, like you got a problem. Did, did, you, did you hear me fucking your mom back in the day and you was in the room and you're mad at me? I'm sorry. Your mom was a whore. I cremated her. I apologize. <laughs> like, because you got a lot of motherfuckers that be mad at me because back in the day they heard me fucking their mom in the other room talking crazy, slapping my dick off their mother face, and now they still mad at me 10, 15 fucking years later. <laughs> My fault, young boy, I, I, when you was 12 and I walked in there and told you to give me some Kool-Aid out the refrigerator, I'm about to glaze your mom. I didn't know you was going to be mad at me 16 fucking years, 20 years later, 21 years later. I was a fucking, I was 19 back then when I glazed your mom. My fault. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm. Just chill, smoke the blunt. Just relax. That's all you gotta do. Smoke your blunt, relax. But you're right. Nobody supposed to be being at work, getting smart. But I'm gonna keep it all we real. It be the black women that act like that. It, I'm not gonna lie. That's true. It's true. Spanish women, white women, Brazilian women. All of them. They don't fucking act like that. It only be the fucking black women. How yeah, you doing? Black. Wait, bitch, true. I'm not trying to talk to you, bitch. I it spoke. Is. The, the fuck black is you retarded? Women, the black women feel like they could just bark. <laughs> they could just automatically bark. But black women feel like that because... Maybe they're waking up every day looking at themselves like, damn, why I look like this? And be mad as shit that they got to walk to a motherfucking job, bald as shit, small-ass ponytail, can't even tie it. 
be at work with a a low ass ponytail that can't even wrap around a ponytail. Man, that ain't no fucking up. excuse. You gotta be the best person you could be no matter how you was born. You some think you think people, I was gonna let some fucking hair hold me the fuck back? Some people is huh? some females are insecure about themselves. You, you know, think I was gonna let some fucking hair hold me the fuck back from being great? Huh? Shit, shit, you could be bald and still look good. Huh? Fuck it, I could be bald and still look good. I'm bald and ugly. But guess what? <laughs> but guess what? My vernacular is spectacular. Yes. Let me tell you one thing I know. <laughs> Your mouthpiece like mine. <laughs> you don't need looks. Yeah. Fuck wrong with you. Looks so I don't want here. I'm ugly. So I don't want here. So, so, like, they be ugly, so that's why they be me. I don't like fucking body want here. That shit. Yeah. Fuck wrong with you. This is ugly, so they mad at life. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> talking about maybe I had a bad day. Bitch, you're at work. What the fuck are you talking about? You're making money. You, you you're, you're at work. Like what? Like when you have a bad day, it's like uh, once I get to work, I gotta tighten the fuck up now. I can't not come to work to with my bad day. Like oh, I'm having a bad day, so I'm gonna bring that shit to work. What the fuck are you talking about? Like. Yeah. You're not supposed to bring all that drama, all that stress to your job. Once you enter your job, all that shit's supposed to be out that fucking door. Not supposed to come into your job. You're not supposed to take your anger out on motherfuckers that you don't even know. Motherfuckers is here. First of all, first of all, years. you knew they knew they was on some bullshit because when the rest of security come up, they like the bitch said what? <laughs> mm -hmm. The fuck are you talking about? Like bitch, you. You're at the front. When people come in, you're here to greet them. What, what the fuck are you talking about? So you mean to tell me people going to walk in and they go, how you doing? And you just going to ignore everybody because you're having a bad fucking day? Yeah. What kind of shit is that? How old are you? 19. Oh, they talk about don't you got school to borrow with shit. <laughs> That's why I stack my middle finger. Like, my fault. So what you doing right now? You you your boyfriend there? No. You got a boyfriend? You know I do. We be on here all the time. I'm saying I talk to a lot of people. I ain't got your file in front of me. All right. right. But no, we're not together. Well, oh, not oh, we're so. not together, but we so. just not. Like we needed some. Wow, what would he do? It's not. It's, it's like I don't know. Like he just he need to get himself together. What he do? He don't just, don't take up for him. Say what the fuck he did. What he do? Uh, it's just a lot of arguing. You know how somebody try to sit here and accuse you like of arguing or try to accuse you. Uh, basically try to say something and I'm like my like my nigga I'm not even saying enough I'm sitting here quiet and you sitting here try to argue with me and it's not making no sense how you gonna sit here and argue with me and I ain't even saying shit to you but you telling everybody else that I'm the cause of the problem I'm always arguing but I'm sitting here quiet can I ask you a question you got a light skinned boyfriend don't you mm -hmm. what the fuck you expect a light skinned nigga to act like a light skinned nigga. You knew what you signed up for, right? I sure for be. Huh? Yeah. When a nigga fell asleep like this the first night. You knew what the fuck you was in for. Mm-hmm. Now you fell in love with a light skinned nigga. He argue with you all the time. Take long to get dressed. Always hogging up the mirror. Now you mad. Yeah, that too. I hate when you gotta look in the mirror. You wanna do your waves for about a whole hour. The hell? That motherfucker waves not gonna be there in the next five minutes. Hey, you know what? I can't even tell you get you a new nigga because I kind of fuck with your boyfriend, though. He a cool little nigga, though. He cool. That's the nigga you know, that's always playing. That's the nigga that's always playing the game, right? Yeah, Fortnite with his toes out. 
light skin nigga shit. Like, he's sitting there with the headphones and his toes out. Light skin nigga <laughs> shit. Toes gripping the carpet and shit. Like, yeah, long ass grippers. Like, you think a toes gripping the tar carpet like a polar bear. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. You knew you were you knew you were sided up for that when you got with her. I did. That's why I'm not I'm not complaining. I do at the end of the day, you know, I'm not gonna say I'm I'm grown, but I'm not grown. You feel me? I'm not gonna say I'm gonna say, you know, I don't got time to be arguing, I don't got time to be mad, I don't got time to be stressing, I'm still young. Right. And I'm not going to stress about something I don't got to stress about. You're right. going to live life with me. You're going to make money. And that's what's going to be. It's no arguing. Ain't none of that. It's well, you know, you know, he, so, so, was y'all, y'all was living together, right? Yeah. You, he ain't there. You put him out? No, I left. Oh, you left. Mm -hmm. Oh, you weren't playing no fucking games. That's what the fuck I'm talking about. Made that nigga get his mind right. He calling yet? Oh, we been texting. Oh, yeah, because you know what? You know what's going through his mind right now? He don't want no other nigga to glaze you. He don't want you to meet no other nigga. Yeah. Tell him you keep playing, nigga. All right. That's what I said. And it's not being ignorant, but it's a lot of people in this world that could do much more but i ain't i ain't no bougie ass bitch i don't need no nigga to always get my nails done get my hair done no i'm gonna get that myself if i gotta get my nails i'm gonna get it done myself my hair i'm not depending on no nigga to do nothing for me i'm gonna do that on my own right so at the end of the day yeah i expect you to do for me make sure i eat shit if i make sure you eat and i make sure you cool nigga you better do the same thing because you want to right it's one hand pieces. wash the other nigga yeah, let me tell that niggas. One hand wash the other niggas. It ain't no I look out for you. I look out for the cookout. But you don't bring no motherfucking spoons, forks, no cheap ass days, sodas, or nothing, nigga. Mm -hmm. Fuck wrong with him. You just want to play Fortnite all day with your feet gripping the floor like a fucking muskrat. <laughs> He's crazy. Fuck wrong with him. Tell him if you knew better, you do better, nigga. Know what I mean? That's... Sometimes you just got to do what you got to do uh -huh. to proceed in life. You mm -hmm. can't let nobody stop you. Mm -hmm. So when he be texting you, what he be saying? He just texted me. He was like, he act today. He said, what are you doing? I said, nothing. I'm getting my nails done. Okay. He was like, I want to see when you're done. I was like, all right, I'll show you. But I never showed him. They show him, they text him, nothing. So I went to the store, and we end up seeing each other. He like, so you ain't gonna show me, you ain't show me your nails, you ain't text me about your nails. Look at you, you full of good. You got everything done, your eyebrows, your nails, your feet. And I'm like, yes, I did. Shit, yes, I am feeling good. There you go. I don't feel bad. They supposed I feel to say, I feel great, good. nigga. Shit. See, I feel great, nigga. Oh my God, I'm elated. I am so fucking happy. Oh my God, I'm stress free. God damn. See, you know what it is? The happier you seem, the more he gonna want you back. Because he gonna mm -hmm. think, nigga, oh, what the fuck she's so happy for? We ain't together. Who got her? What's, who she talking to? <laughs> There you go. You know oh, something. You know something. Now he he come with the threats. Ben, I be no other nigga. I'm telling you, I'm gonna fuck you up. You know, nigga. Shut up, pussy. Who the fuck you talking to? The fuck you like, talking to? I talk to whoever fuck I want to talk to. I'm single. Oh, you single? Oh, you fucking single? You ain't fucking single. You, you better stop fucking <laughs> playing with me. Shut your light skin ass up. At the end of the day, if they get your shit together, well, bounce. That's all you, all you can say. No more arguing. No more nothing. 
Did you do something wrong, though? No. You did? I mean, to be honest, I'm going to be honest. What I did do is I told him to fuck off. I said, fuck off. He kept yapping his mouth. I said, fuck off. Fuck you. Fuck off. Like, when somebody aggravates you to the point where you don't even got, like, you want to say something and it just come out and you just like, man, fuck off. Fuck you. Like, I don't even want to say what I got to say because you just, you blowing my shit now. Just shut the fuck up. So I said that and I walked out the door. He was like, all right. It's just like that. So if you said what you said, keep it like that. And I sure the fuck am. Fuck off. Can't repeat it. Wow. I did apologize because I was wrong. Oh, okay. But at the end of the day, I wasn't wrong at the same time. Fuck off. Oh, okay. But well, see, I appreciate and... you tapping in with me, little mama. You too, Gilly. All love. Have a good night. You too.